Hi there. How's everybody doing today? Hey, everybody. Oh, no, I know it's hot, but you can do better than that. How's everybody doing? All Great. right. Great. Welcome to the Bugs Bunny World Games here at Six Flags Over Georgia. Bugs in this house have created three loony cartoony games for six young contestants to play. That's right. As a reminder, we'd like to tell you that there's no smoking inside the theater. And also, parents, please keep your children seated at all times throughout the performance for their safety as well as for the characters. Right now, though, we're looking for three boys and three girls between the ages of five and nine to play in the games. Kids, if you're interested, stay seated and raise your hands real high so we can see them, okay? All right. Well, I'll get the boys. All right. So I'll get the... The girl. I knew that. All right. All right. I'm so proud of you. All right. Baby. I get the girls. So All right. Smart. You have to be between five you and nine, play? okay? Okay. Go up Let's on stage. I see you one play? here. Okay. I want over one here. from the a back. Girl over here. A girl over Let here. Let me find one from Let's the back. Let's see. Um, Are you between you five and glasses. nine? Come on okay, up. Come on, sweetheart. And let's All see right. I got my guys. Come on. All right. This is a good looking group today. Sure is. Have a great audience. There we go. Wow. I like your hat. Can I have it? No? Okay. <laughs> Where are my other girls? There's one of my girls. Here's my boy. There's that okay. one. Okay. Well, folks, I have a question for you. Who are you here to see? Bugs Bunny. Well, you know, Bugs like something even more than carrots. What is that, Carrie? Applause. That's right. So let's go ahead and give this group of great-looking contestants a good round of applause. All right, guys. Go and sit down on the front bench. Sit down beside the person who has the same color vest on as you because that's your team member, okay? And, boys, I promise the girls won't try to kiss you. But I might. That's for us, Carrie. All right, anyway, I think I hear him coming. Let's get it one more time. Let's give a big round of applause for Bugs Bunny. All right. And now, he's cool, he's funny, he's Bugs Bunny. Right. Hey, what's up, Doc? What's cooking? What's up, Doc? Are you looking for Bugs Bunny Bunting? Time to quit your hunting. For the best, I recommend some time with me, your furry friend. What's up, Doc? What's cooking? Yes, sir, we're hot. Ow! We'll surprise everyone with our tons of fun. Hey, what's up, Doc? We really mean it. What's up, Doc? Hey, Bugs Bunny here, and you must be the audience, right? Why don't you put your mitts together and make some noise so you know who you are? That, that, that's enough. That's enough. You see, I'd like you to save some applause for a couple of friends of mine, our co-hosts. Come on out and take a bow. Hi, everybody. I'm Carrie. And I'm Rick. And let's hear it for our referee. Everybody say, hey, Corey. And now it's my duty, a, uh, a pleasure to introduce another uh, um, a member of the cast, the talented <coughs> and the hardest waking duck in show business, Daffy Duck. All right, Buster, let's clear the adjective here. Talented? Come on, Rabbit. I've got more talent in my pinky than most stars have in their whole career. Hmm. Whatever happened to words like brilliant, extraordinary, unprecedented? You forgot to take a bow. Your public is watching. Hmm? Bow? Oh. Oh, yes, my bow. Thank you, thank you, legions of fans. I thank you. And now... Uh, um, and, and now... Uh... What happens now? Oh, come on, Daffy, you know it's time for the Bugs Bunny World Games to begin. All, All right. right. Y'all go get ready, okay? Carrie, take it away. And now, ladies and gentlemen, the moment you've all been waiting for. What's that? I don't know, but it's about to crash. Oh, look at it. Oh. <laughs> oh, drat. Oh, bother. Next time I get an automatic transmission. <laughs> Ew, that was not amusing. Whoa there, little fella. Who are you? Oh, come on, Carrie. Everybody knows that. Tell her, kids. Marvin the Martian. Yep. Oh. I have come to your puny planetary habitat to see if there is any sign of intelligent life. That way I can remove it before I destroy this miserable place. Isn't that lovely? Hmm? Oh, you can't do that. Ah, uh, besides Marvin, you're just a cartoon character. Yeah. <laughs> Ew, that makes me very angry. <laughs> very angry indeed. And I thought there was intelligent life here. Did somebody say intelligent life? 
Say, Hoff, if it's intelligent life you're looking for, search no further. Why, this is the place. We're slopping over with intelligent life here. Hey, what's all the racket? Uh-oh. It's that cranky little fella from outer space. Uh, what's his name again? Tell him, kids. Marvin, Marvin the, the Martian. Martian. Trying to horn in on the Bugs Bunny World Games without an invite, are you? World Games, you say? Just how many worlds have been invited? Oh, well. Might as well let him stay and watch. But uh, don't stand so close to the players, Shorty. Don't want you to get hurt. Uh, uh, have a seat, General. Just to show you how it works, I'll go first. Wait a second. What number am I thinking of? Uh, 23? Wrong. I'll go first. And if our loyal but underpaid crew will simply roll the film, I'll show you how to play. I'm sick of people taking bows for my talent. Now do your own dance. I challenge you. Dance, if you're not a coward. Hardy har har. If they like that mess, they're starving for some real hoofing. I'll kill them. Music, my soul, please. E flat from the top. Ingrates. There. Your eyes ain't lying. The rabbit bends the rules. But not me. No, sir. I'm a straight shooter. And if I may have some assistance, I'll show you just how straight. Ahem. Assistance? Some assistance, if you please. Pretty ingenious, eh, sports fans? Let me show you the ropes. Oh, Rapture. Is this game on video? And how many targets are there? Uh, uh, here's one for you. And it's autographed. Down in front, down in front. Look, kids, it's simple. All you do is aim. No batteries or distracting arguments required, you'll notice. Just aim and presto! Like, uh, this? Ow! That's low ball. Let's try this again, except you stand over there. Whatever makes you happy. And, just to make it fair, each team gets three shots at the target. All right, ladies, come on up here. We're going to start with the red team, then the blue team, and then the yellow team, okay? So, yellow team, you're here. Red team, you're up here, sweetheart. What's your name? Cindy. Cindy. All right, Corey, let's show Cindy and the other girls how to work this thing here. Okay, you're just going to pull the arm back towards Rick and presto. Just like that, okay? Got it, Cindy? All right, I think she's ready, Carrie. Referee, will you start the game? I sure will. On your mark, get set, go! All right, okay, Cindy, here we go. On. And a three-pointer, all right. Good one. You get two more shots, sweetheart. Hold on, let me hit that ball. There now, you I go. know you can make one and more. And oh, a rebound. There you okay, go. well, you get one more, Cindy. Make it count, okay? There you go. And Ew, a oh, that a rebound. Was a all right, for a toe, Bob. Three points. Three all points. Right. Let's hear it for Cindy, audience. Come Great job, Cindy. Cindy. Come on, you can do it. Our second contestant, what's your Not name? Bad. Tahisha. Okay, come over here, sweetheart. Here you go. Pull that lever back. Hit this time. And oh no, a rebound. Okay, well you get two more. Seconds. There you go. There you go. And a three-pointer. All, All right. right. Good, Good shot. Oh go. boy, that was great. And a six-pointer for a total of nine points. Nine points. Let's hear it for Tahisha. All right. Good job. Not least, we have the yellow team. What's your name, Megan, all right, here you go. Here you go, Megan. Come on, you can do it. And a three-pointer for Megan. Good start. Here you go. Take that second shot. And a two-pointer. All right, Megan, last shot, okay? Here you go. And it's a one-pointer for all a total right. of six points. Six points for Megan. Six Come on, points. audience, let's hear it for Megan. Job. Great job, ladies. Come up here and take a bow for the audience. All right, thank you. Great job, ladies. Now let's check out the scoreboard. Great first round. In the end, the red team comes in third, earning one carrot. Yellow team earns two for second place. And the blue team comes in first, earning three carrots. Right. Great job. Great job, blue team. But the red and yellow team can still catch up because we have two more games to go. Yeah, but you know, that was a fun game. Oh, it was. Let's see a top flat. Huh. After you, shortcakes. 
Ooh, this is such a thrill, demonstrating intelligent life to these Earthlings. Will someone activate the video scanners? Eh, uh, pardon me again, Doc, but, uh, just what did you mean by that crack about the Earth being gone? Oh, uh, I'm going to blow it up. It obstructs my view of Venus. It does? That's a shame. Where's the kaboom? There was supposed to be an earth-shattering kaboom. The Illudium Pu-36 explosive space modulator. That creature has stolen the space modulator. Ooh, how embarrassing. But, being of extreme intelligence, I have come equipped this time with my new improved Illudium Pu-37 explosive space modulator. Hmm. Nice little piece of hardware you got there, Doc. How's it work? <laughs> got it. It's absolutely theft-proof. In fact, if anyone should move at a distance of even 50 Quinkleforbs away from me... Yeah, we get the picture. Oh, that wasn't a bit nice. Ducks are meant for cooking. Or stoop labor. Oh, you don't want to cook Daffy. He's too tough. You got that right, sister. Because sometimes I fight with the gloves off for truth, justice, and the right to park wherever you want. Yeah, that's foul play. <laughs> and when that time arises, I change from being an ordinary little black duck into the enemy of cosmic crime, Duck Dodgers in the 24th and a half century! Ha-ha! <laughs> Got the drop on you with my disintegrating pistol! And brother, when it disintegrates, it disintegrates. <laughs> Well, what do you know? It's disintegrated. Happy your be be birthday, you with a thing from another world, you. Oh, thank you. That was a nasty thing to do. If you really want to show me your superior intelligence, try running my Martian obstacle course. The object of this game is for each of you to try and get your hands on the space modulator before time runs out and I blow up the Earth. Isn't that just jolly? Hmm? Oh, just jolly with sugar on it, Doc. Firstly, you must crawl through this long Martian canal. My dance card's full, Scarlet. I'll just wait right there where the kids will climb out. Secondly, you will have to pick up these moon rocks and try to hit me with all three of them before I can zap you with my Acme Disintegrating Zapper. And I will, too. Oh, don't that sound like fun? What a maroon from the moon. I'll pretend I didn't hear that. Besides, I'm from Mars! Eh. Then, the thirdly thing you do is climb up this ladder and slide down through the time travel tunnel that will take you to my Martian laboratory. Well, that doesn't sound too tough. And then they run over to the ray gun neutralizer and pull out the space modulator before time runs out. Right? I knew she was intelligent. Uh, she's not all that intelligent. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, uh, Carrie, why don't you bring the guys around? And Corey, let's go through it one more time. Okay, you're going to run through the Martian Space Canal, throw three moon rocks at Marvin, go up and down the time travel tunnel, run over to the ray gun neutralizer, and pull out the space modulator. I can hardly contain myself. Hmm? Lane? Lee? Okay, this is Lee with the red team. All right, Lee. Hey, Marvin, are you ready to start the game? Ready? Set? Go! Come on, Lee. Here we go. All right. Here we go, Lee. Over here. Throw these moon rocks at Marvin. And one. Two more, Lee. And two. One more. And three. Come on, Lee. Hurry. All right. We got a baseball player on our hands. Time in the time travel tunnel. Faster. Faster. Fun. All right, bud. Over here. And time. Time for the red team. Nineteen seconds. Let's hear it for Lee. High five, Lee. What's your name, hon? All right. Zach. Okay. This is Zach with the blue team. Marvin, if you will. Ready, set, 
Go! Come on, Zach. Here we go. All right, hurry now. Over here, Zach. Throw those at Marvin. Hurry up now. Uh, Marvin, throw to Marvin. All right, here he goes. And you can do it. Okay. That's good. Not violent. All right, here we go. Not violent. Get going. Come on, Zach. Keep time in the time travel tunnel. There he goes. Way to go. All right. And here he comes. He's fun. Woo. Oh. Woo. Hurry up there now. you are. And time. Time for the blue team. 22 seconds. All right. How about it for Great Zach? Job. Good job, Zach. Okay, this is Anthony with the yellow team. Hey, Marvin, one more time. Ready, set, go! All right, Anthony, Anthony come, come on, on now. Here we go. He's going to throw the moon go. rock. And one, and two, one more. Go. Okay, All right, come on, Anthony, hurry. Yellow team support. He's coming. There you go. Tunnel. You can do it. And he's fun. Over here, Anthony. And time. Time for the yellow team. 13 seconds. Right. Good job, Anthony. Wow. That was good. Oh, how impressive. All these younger Earth creatures seem to have advanced intelligence. Great job, guys. Now let's check out the scoreboard. All right, great second round. Close one, too. The blue team comes in third, earning one carrot. The red team earns two for second place. The yellow team comes in first this time, earning three carrots. All right. Good job. Well, the scores are close, but we have one more game to go. So let's get to it. Hey, Buzz, it's your turn. Wow. Oh, brother. Mr. Humility. Now, for the final game, I tried to come up with something that would require a lot of skill. Er, uh, but not too much. There's a difficult challenge. Very funny, Einstein. Let the games commence. Well, I call this game the Barber of Six Flags. Though I must admit, I've used an idea like this before. Want to see it? A hey, uh, roll the next clip, Doc. How about a nice close shave? Teach your whiskers to behave. Lots of lather, lots of soap. Please hold still, don't be a dope. Now we're ready for the scraping. There's no use to try escaping. Yell and scream and rant and rave. It's no use, you need a shave. Ooh, ouch, ouch, ooh, ouch, ooh, ooh, ouch. And you're nice and clean. Although your face looks like it might have gone through a machine. Now, in this game, each of you will become the barber. But you have to be careful, because if you shave too close... A kaboom! A head-shattering kaboom! Settle down, Grizzly. You're stalling. Explain away, Bugsy old sport. Now, the first kid will take a marker and draw a face on the balloon. The second kid puts the shaving cream on the balloon face, and then the first kid shaves the face of the balloon. Simple. And watch out for the kaboom. Got a little on you there, Bugs. All right, everybody, come on up here. The red team's by Marvin. The yellow team's over here with Daffy, and we're the blue team. All right, here you go. It's not going to pop. Okay, now what we're going to do, when the, um, Corey says go, the girls are going to draw a face on the balloon with a marker. And then the boys are going to lather up the very top of the balloon with the shaving cream. That's right. And then it's back to the girls with a close shave with a knife. But be careful. Or like Marvin said, you'll get a big kaboom. <laughs> Sorry. Rick, fix him. Uh. Hey, Daff, will you keep time? Certainly. I've got all the time in the world. Right. The first kid draws. The second kid lathers him up. Then back to the first kid to give him a shave. Is everybody ready? Ready. ready? On your marks. Get set. Go. go! All right, girls, draw a face on the balloon. I'm like, right, hurry up now. Right. Careful right. now. Oh, that kind of looks like Rick. That's good. Okay, I'll be careful. Okay, let her up. There you go. Okay, now, come on up. 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 Come all right, there you go over here. We well, you know, folks, it was a close game, but in the end, the red team came in first by a hair. <laughs> and the blue team came in second by a whisker. <laughs> and the red team came in third by a nose. <laughs> Sorry. Now it's a bad show. All right. There you good go. game, Daffy. Good game. Just good. 
Whatever happened to words like, like, superlative, splendid, inspirational? The same thing that happened to words like quiet, polite, and sportsmanlike. Hear it one more time for our great contestants. They all did wonderful... a super job today, didn't they? And now it's time for us to check today's final scores for the Bugs Bunny World Game. Well, folks, everybody was so good, we have a three-way tie. It's six carats all around. Everybody all right. wins. All right. <laughs> Great! Yay. Congratulations! Nice All right! Super duper! And what's a better way to end a competition than with an award ceremony? Gentlemen, start your medals. Hey, uh, hit it, Doc. On behalf of Six Flags, we now present each of you with an official Bugs Bunny Royal Games Medal of Honor. And you all deserve it, too. Stellar! Simply stellar! Stellar! That's the word I was looking for! Dick Daffy! He puts the pity back in competitor. Well, you know what, Carrie? I think everybody did a great job today, don't you? Oh, they're all winners. They are, audience. Give it up one more time for the real stars of the show, our contestants! All right! All right. Wave to your audience. You're famous now. Wave to everybody. Here you go. All right. All right, everybody. Thanks for coming with us. Overture. Curtain to lights. This, this is it. it. The night, night of nights. No more rehearsing and nursing our parts. We know every part by heart. On with the show. This is it. Ladies and gentlemen, the cast of the Bugs Bunny World Games. Daffy Duck. Marvin the Martian. And now for the star of our show, it's Bugs Bunny. Let's hear it one more time for our great co-hosts, Carrie and Rick. And on behalf of Carrie, myself, and the entire Bugs Bunny World game, thanks for coming to the show, and y'all have a great day here at Six Flags Over Georgia. And while you're at Six Flags, don't forget to try the Carrot Club's dining experience. Mm. With Bugs and his pals located just around the corner in Bugs Bunny World. And kids, if you didn't get a chance to play this show, there's still three more today at... 1.30, 3.30, and, and 4.30. See you then. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, everybody. Y'all have a good day. Stay right here, y'all. Bye for now. See you later. Goodbye. Goodbye. Bye. Don't forget to turn left and out.